So car is started currently and I'm gonna take off here. And I should add, I'm on a very desolate road. There's no traffic around. So please don't try this at home or in your own car. So as I pull out here, I'm just gonna go ahead and touch the button. And indeed, the car shuts off. I was going below five miles an hour. So what would happen if you're driving in pretty much highway speeds? I'm now on a road where I can get the car up to normal speeds. Uh, because the interesting thing to find out is if the car would actually shut off if you accidentally were to hit the start button while driving on the highway. So I'm going to get the car up to uh, about 50 miles an hour. And again, I'm doing this on a road where I know there's hardly any traffic. There's no cars in front of me. There's no cars behind me. Remember to always stay safe. But let's find out what happens. Okay, I'm up to 40 miles an hour and 50 miles an hour, 55, and I'm gonna hit the button. Nothing happens. So at least on these Fords, Ford Motor Company has incorporated a uh, safety feature. So if you accidentally hit the button while driving on highway speeds, you're still safe, which is a very good thing. Now, if the situation were to happen where you actually have to turn the car off, um, let's say your throttle's stuck or something, I mean, you wanna be able to stop the car. There is a way where you can actually shut off the ignition. So I'm gonna show you right now. The ignition turned off. So you see everything went blank. Put the car back in park. It says transmission not in park. Start it. So there's also a feature where if you hold the button in for at least three seconds, your car will shut off. 